Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome, welcome. Thanks again for the fill. We are doing one case of World Cup Prism, case break number 181. I am Soccer Breakers FC. If interested in joining my breaks, join our Facebook group, Soccer Breakers FC. All breaks are live on YouTube. Also, check out our website, www.soccerbreakersfc.com. We break soccer, only soccer, and lots of soccer. So we're breaking soccer five nights a week, four, three, four, five cases a night. So uh, if you want to break soccer, you are in the correct place. All right, here are your players and teams. I'm not going to read them all off. I'll just show them for the camera so you guys know who you got. Good luck, Idhi, coming in strong with Argentina, Manny. Gonzalez, Germany, Mexico, Michael Espinoza coming in with a boatload of teams. Miguel Angel Arroyo, Tommy with Portugal and France, big boys, and the other Tommy with Brazil. Manny got Spain. Good luck. Let's do this. Sick case, please. One time. One time, one time. Yes, this stuff is gonna have to go down there. So go down there. Guys, uh, teams are selling in the next one, 182. I put the link up there, links right now on YouTube. Uh, if you wanna get in on 182, that is the case that is breaking uh, Later tonight, I hope, if we fill it. If not, then we'll break it tomorrow. But uh, that's the link right there. If you're on YouTube, look to the chat and you shall see the link. All right, good luck, guys. Here we go. So how y'all doing tonight? I hope you are all fine and dandy. Not just fine, but dandy as well. All right, Norm. Yep, it'll be right after this. Last I checked, there was five spots left. I don't know if uh, any more have sold. Um, yeah, if anybody, if you see spots selling on Facebook, if anybody uh, is monitoring that, please let me know. Uh, I will take them off here. So. Davis, you need to post in the filler post.
right, so four left. Four left. Four left in the filler for select that is going to be our next break. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad, Feliz Navidad, Prospero Año, Felicidad. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas, I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. Ah, trying to pawn off your not one of one Baggio's on me, huh? Uh, I'll check it out, Jasper. Depends on for what. Probably not to buy, but if you're just interested in trade, then... Yeah, maybe. Let's see if I have an extra Maldini I can spare. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of my heart. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Any Jose Feliciano fans in the house? Feliz Navidad. Prospero Año. Felicidad. That's what I was going to say. Let's see. I, honestly, I don't know. Jordan Henderson. We shall see. Uh, Juan Cuadrado, Juan Cuadrado. Yeah, I would think if it's like the same exact card, Baggio, Maldini, Baggio would probably go for a little more, I'm guessing. But, I don't know, if yours is like the 10, the other one's nicer to 5, I don't know, we'll see. I'm not, I, honestly, I don't remember. If I remember correctly, I think I have two Maldinis, I don't. I think I have, I know I have at least one. I just can't remember if I have one or two. I'm pretty sure I don't have three. Fimbagasen. Onate. And I don't think we have any joint Maldinis with uh, Itchy because we can never get them anymore. Oviedo. Because it's impossible to get Maldini now. Out of bed. Godoy and Perez. I was thinking of like moving Maldini up like eight or nine bucks and drop in like maybe Toti instead or something like that. Saiz or Bird Camp or one of those guys, but I think I'm just gonna leave it the way it is. Musa for now. Uh Henderson. Did he got Maldini in the next one? England. Veron. Berg. Perez. That's cool if he gets Maldini. We used to take Maldini like way back when other people weren't that interested in Maldini. 65 of 65, Embolo. Sophie. Giovanni Dos Santos. All right, later, Jasper. Go make some money, man. Carvalho to 149. Jimenez. Cochran. Koulibaly. Hodgsafi. Hosseini, Oso, 
Icardi. got what next break He got Baggio. Oh, Jasper didn't get Baggio this time. He got Baggio last one, huh? Who got Maldini? Somebody way up top had to get Maldini. Dibala, Bati, CR7 logo, Bati, 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 De Rossi, Baggio, De Rossi, Gullet. Crash, Baggio, Trezeguet, Lothar, Dybala. Wow. If he got, you're right, he did get Maldini. I can't believe it. Pretty sick. Sakai. Rodriguez. El Ahmadi, PK, what's going on? Nobody wants uh, Maldini anymore? That's weird. Witzel to 125. That's the first time I've seen Maldini go like past the first 10 posts. Erickson, Connections, Brian Ruiz, and Borges. Uh, Cuadrado, Icardi, Hamed. Sweden, Sal, Cruz, Igalo to one ninety nine, Cuadrado, Fimgasen, Dembele, Nani. Al Abed, Coutinho, Dos Santos, Jachio, Neymar to one twenty five, uh, Herrera, Sterling to one twenty five, Lukaku, Senor Lukaku. Twenty-seven people in here, guys. Hopefully, uh, four of the twenty-seven of you want to join the next uh, break, which is going to be select. All right, Luca just took one. My name is Luca. I live on the second floor. Mm. 
All right, let's get this all sleeved up. Uh, he already has spots in this. Let's see, who are we missing? Sidichak, maybe Sadumi or Supa. They want any action. Guys, are we ready? Thank you, Luca. Thanks, Luca. Appreciate it. That'll be next. Uh, three left now that Luca grabbed the spot. Three left. Four oh nine. Four eleven. Good luck, good luck. You in Toronto, Luca? Which part again of Canada are you from? I think Ontario, or am I wrong? I can't remember. Is it East Coast time, or so is it already 1 a.m. over there, or is it not that late? Toronto, there you go. I've been to Toronto many times. I got my uncle lives in Toronto. My cousins all live in Oakville. My grandmother lived there too in Oakville, but she passed away about 10 years ago. So I had a lot of family up there. Yep, 117. You a Toronto FC fan? It's amazing how that team went from coming within like inches of winning the Champions League for CONCACAF and then they just sucked the next year. I don't know what happened that quickly. I think they pretty much had the same team, didn't they? I don't think they like lost a bunch of players or anything. Juve, all right. You're a Baggio guy too, probably. Huh. I mean, Buffon guy.
Hazvi Asensio to forty uh, Asensio again Mario to one twenty five Al Jasim Iran Gutierrez Banega Blue Romero Rogic, Korich to 125, Marquinhos, Portugal, uh, Sophie, Enzo Perez to 65, one of 65, there's Neuer, Al Shehri, Lozano, Malul Kane Akinfeev Yamaguchi Farfan Alui, Bertongan, whoa, I kind of just cut that to the auto there. All right, let's leave that there. That's going to be the auto. I kind of saw it already. I don't know if you guys did, but Gueye. Koshelny, Bjarnson, Brazil Connections, Andre Silva, Lewandowski. Uh, that was Quadrado. Lustig, Icardi. Lecky to one ninety nine, Vermalen or Malen to one forty nine, Laspina, Gomes, Payet, Mitrovic. Uh, Falcao, Malu, Diao, Shinwook, Duryak, Renato Sanchez, Iceland, 
Werner. And our autograph was going this way, Mr. Gilfie Sigurdsson, Iceland. Gilfie Sigurdsson, Iceland. So pretty mellow start there. A couple of not so great autos and a couple of laser boxes. Subasic. We got the crappy stuff out of the way. Now only the sick stuff.
Alright, let's see what we got here. Three left. Done. So, Sarumi, that's spot 19, and Douglas Chiang got the other two. Alright, we are sold out, guys. Douglas, good luck. Yep, thank you, Michael. Appreciate it, man. We are full. Yarnson, Alui, Chesney, Sigurdsson. Wow, nice. 23 of 25 for Germany. Mojo Champions card, number to 25. He's got Deutschland this time. Germany, Manuel Gonzalez. Manuel Gonzalez. I'm going to make sure we get those Mannies separated out because we got two different Mannies in this break. Asking for trouble for my sorter there, Gonzalez and Oliveira. So I'll make sure uh, we get that sorted out. 23 of 25. Kostic. We got Australia. Neymar. Rakitic, Coutinho, Baca, Koke, Connections, come on, then we got Shakiri. 15 of 20. Osel. Korich to 149. We got Lischsteiner. We got Farfan. Banega. All right, thank you, Douglas. Got your payment. Another missort. TPG. Um, Tops Premier Gold. Oops. Oh. Sorry. Yeah, it sounds like that was my son. I'll let him know. Hamed to 199. My apologies about that. Thanks, Michael, for catching that. I appreciate it. Let me know what uh, the shipping deal is. I'll, I'll give you uh, some break credit for that. Olsen, anyway, really appreciate it. Osmoon. Uh, Herrera. Slitty. Is it the West Ham and Burnley? Yeah. Campbell. We haven't done a lot of EPL lately, so Morata. All right, 
appreciate it. Yeah, honestly, knock on wood, he's been doing really well. I mean, at first uh, he was making, you know, I was catching like two or three mistakes a week. But lately, uh, knock on wood, um, yeah, I mean, I haven't been, I mean, I've been doing so much and he's been sorting so much that uh, luckily, like, I don't know, maybe I get like, I mean, not, not any more than the mistakes that I would make myself, you know, I mean, every couple weeks, you know, a card or two may get misplaced or missent, but considering we're doing, you know, 25 cases a week, uh, he's been doing pretty good. Uh, Messi, uh, Niguez, Sturridge, PK, Cavani, Patricio, and the good thing is, I mean, almost everybody, like when there's a mistake, you guys are all super honest about it and people contact me right away. So, Australia. We've only had like one or two occasions where cards have been lost in the last like six months to a year. El Ahmadi, Mohammadi, uh, Jimenez, Yeah, the thing, the, the most common mistake that he was making was when he was bagging them, sometimes he'd write the wrong name on the bag. So it wasn't so much that he missorted the cards, but, you know, like he would look across and, you know, instead of putting like Tommy Rutherford, he would put like Tommy, you know, Fitzhugh or something like that. You know, th those kind of mistakes were the ones. Rui Patricio, that not a lot, but the few times that, you know, there were usually problems, that was it. Carrillo and Polo. It usually involved putting the wrong name on the bag. Not so much, you know, sorting the wrong guy into the wrong stack. Kihi, uh, Honda, Firmino, although that obviously has happened a few times too. Banega to 199. Goretzka. Yeah. The ones that I always tell them to like double check, triple check. I'm like, if something's magged, always like triple check it make sure that you know it's not going to the wrong guy and i usually if like it's a huge hit and i i always like look at the mag cards and make sure that they're going to the right person subasic to 149 but you know very few cards are magged so 99 percent of the ones if he screws it up i'm not going to catch it milich lewandowski andy polo a little nacho that is nacho cheese nigeria yeah if it was a messy honest that would really you're right <laughs> that would really you're like wait a minute yeah luckily i haven't had I don't think I've ever had a card that's like over 50, 60 bucks. Uh, Dibala get lost or sent to the wrong guy. And Sorifad. Dele Ali. Yeah, especially with uh, Eminence. But with Eminence, it's kind of hard to screw up unless I write the wrong name on the bag when I'm taken out of the box. That's usually uh, pretty straightforward. So luckily haven't had any issues with eminence yet and we've done 79 cases we're gonna do case 80 hopefully tomorrow
Yeah, exactly. Cause I, there's no way I could break this much if he wasn't sorting for there. There's absolutely no way. I mean, I was like 15 was probably my, you know, I mean, 20 was like super maxed out for me. If I did like, if I do 20 breaks, that's like, I, I'm, that's about what I'm doing now. But I, there's no way back then I could do it because for every break, that's another hour of sorting. So when we're doing 20 cases a week, that's 20 hours of sorting, which is basically three days of work. Uh, like three eight-hour days almost, or seven-hour days or whatever. So unless you do like two 10, and literally I was doing like Sundays, I would sort 10, 11 hours a day. Uh, a lot of times it would pour over into Monday. And then I could only really break like three, four days a week. And now... Yeah, it's definitely, I, mean, I feel kind of maxed out right now too a little bit, but let's see. That's why I'm going to try to get him to see if he can help me with the breaks. I do have a shipper, but she only comes in one day a week. So she usually comes in on Tuesdays. Uh, the past couple weeks she's come in Wednesdays just because Tuesday has been Christmas and New Year's. But starting next week, she will be back to coming in on Tuesdays. So like 90% of the sh 80% of the shipping, 90% of the shipping gets done on Tuesdays. I still don't trust her with doing the international packages that are actually larger than the. She does the international bubble mailers, but the international packages like for you, Mike, or for Grooves, or those guys are icky, like guys that do like once a month and have a huge package. Uh, I do those myself, but other than those, uh, she does like a lot of the smaller international shipments too. So yeah, definitely, because I, I would, I mean, I have very little life as it is, but I'd have like no life if that was the case. Yeah, the law. Th Honestly, I'm very close, Mike. I mean, literally, I'm probably, I don't say 90%, but I'd say I'm 80%, you know, retired. I mean, I literally, like today, I went into the law firm at 4 o'clock in the afternoon and I got stuck, but I was there from like 4 to almost 7, I think it was. Uh, but on your average day, I go in maybe three, four days a week, and I go in around three, and I leave around 5.36. So there's no way I can go in the morning. So my clients just think I am the busiest lawyer in the world because I'm always in court in the morning. Because, I mean, I usually break till 3, 4, 5 a.m., so I can't get up before, like, if I get up earlier than 10, I'm like a zombie. I usually try to set the alarm for, like, 10, 10.30, and then get up and try to, you know, be ready to, you know, start my day by like 11 or 12. Yeah, watch all my law clients are watching this. They're like, that's what he's doing. He's sleeping when he's supposed to be in court. Although once in a while, I mean, I have court not very often. I probably have to go to court like once every two, three months now. And that's usually at 8.30 in the morning, which is a real pain in the butt of Uchanajad. Like, Your Honor, this whole 8.30 a.m. thing isn't working for me. Can we uh, schedule it more like 2 p.m., please? Cuyate. Chicharito. Benamor. Shakiri. Sung Yu to 125. Uh, Borges. Brian Ruiz. Cruz. Uh, 
That's right. <laughs> there, buddy. Yeah, I've got rid of pretty much all that I do now is just uh, personal injury. That's it. Ikardi, that's by far the less stressful and easiest uh, branch of law. Memedi to 40, 14 of 40. I used to do a lot of litigation, and that's just stressful and time-consuming. Gabriel Jesus, Jonas Hector, and our autograph is for the Netherlands, Arjen Robin. Arjen Robin of the Netherlands. Now, this definitely is my full-time job now. I am a full-time breaker, part-time lawyer. Biglia to 40, because I, I spend like 40 hours a week doing this. I spend probably maybe tops 10 hours a week practicing law. Iguain, so Rui Patricio, more than 40 hours probably if I add it all up. Probably Paul Pogba to 149. Belgium, only 40 to 50 hours a week breaking, and I think if I work 10 hours in a week for law, that's that's a good week right now. Just enough not to get sued for malpractice. <laughs> Just. Yeah, no, honestly, Tommy, I, yeah, I mean, when I started this, it was just kind of a little hobby joke. My wife kept saying, when are you going to move those damn cards, and how long are you going to be doing this? I was like, ah, oh, the World Cup will be over in, you know, July, and I'll be done with this by, like, August, probably. I don't think anybody will want to buy this stuff after, you know. That was World Cup Prism 2014. And uh, then I just kept doing it and doing it, and she's like, well, we're going to move you to the office now, because... You know, I was in the family room doing it. What is that? And here we are. Ihia Nacho, like four and a half years later. Manzukic. Osmoon to 199. Mueller and Gotza. I think just the timing was right because... Uh, Iniesta, I was just kind of not that crazy about practicing law. Dekeya, after 23, 24 years of being a lawyer. Cavillo, uh, Kalinic, and, you know, I just got into soccer cards at the right time because there was hardly anybody doing it. I mean, when I started breaking, it was just like myself and Sook before he went AWOL and George did a little bit and that was it. I mean, a couple guys did, like, World Cup Prism for, you know, three, four weeks during the World Cup. But as soon as it was over, that was it. Nice, a fan. In the summer, in a couple of, yeah, that's pretty sweet. Bell Honda. That's what my wife was talking about today. She's like, let's uh, enhance the... Uh, Ooh, we got an auto there. Uh, Dembele, I think it's an auto. If it is, it's a dual auto. Uh, Lecky. Kuman. Traustason. She wanted to move uh, my shipping operation into the sunroom. Toivonen and Larsen. I said it's kind of really freezing right now. Well, it's, it happens to be the coldest time of the year, Sanchez. It's not that cold by East Coast standards, but Berg, by San Diego standards, it's freezing right now. Uh, Michael, it's like at night it gets in like the high 40s, which is like really cold for San Diego. We rarely drop under 50. Uh, last year, I'm guesstimating, uh, I can tell you. I'm guesstimating about 1,200 maybe cases 
Uh, Brian Ruiz and Borges. Uh, Hamed Kovacic. Mascherano. Yeah, at least, oh, definitely over a thousand. Definitely under 1500, so somewhere in that range. Mueller to 65. Romero, Mario. Yeah, I know. That's why she was saying like turn the sunroom into. Let's have them like actually get a contractor to come and like convert it into a uh, actual like room. But I don't know. I think it's uh, I'm fine. This room is honestly I've kind of outgrown this room. I could use a bigger room. And the, the main reason why I want a bigger room is so I could have another breaker with me in the same space. This is just too small right now. It's literally a little tiny table that I use. Uh, so, I mean, it's not tiny, but it's not enough for another breaker to be here. So I could definitely, Ryan to 149. I've thought about moving this into my law office because my law office is huge compared to this. Yet an act. And I am paying rent, Morata. So, but the only thing is then, you know, I don't want to be like, it's kind of not dangerous, but yeah, it is kind of dangerous, I guess. It's not, it's not a bad area, but it's not a place you want to be walking around alone at like 3 a.m., 4 a.m. Gunnarsson. Silva and I'd definitely be like the only person in the building at that hour. Uh, Neymar, Nacho. Office from home is 1.7 miles. I have a little red light I hit, and I could like double the length of my commute from like two minutes to four minutes if I hit that red light. So yeah, it's very close. I live my office is. Less than two miles away. I can literally walk it, but I don't. All right, here we go. Good luck, good luck. It is a dual auto. Who is it going to be? I don't know if this is the case hit or not. I have no idea. Well, it's not the case hit, but it is a sick hit. I don't think this is the case hit. Suarez and Cavani. Wow, that is sick. Who's got Uruguay? Uruguay. Michael Espinosa. Sick hit there, Michael. Congrats, man. 26 of 35. That is a sick, sick, sick hit. Yeah, that is unusual. I I have hit. I, I remember there was one case that it was missing. I don't know. I think in the last case we had one, but yeah, you're right. That is unusual. But out of all the hits, if we're gonna miss one, that would be the one that I would most rather miss versus like the national landmarks card. That's a sick hit right there. Or. Uh, You know, obviously the case hit. We don't want to miss that. But oh, did the Cyrillic sell well? I'm not crazy about that whole Cyrillic base thing. At least not for a box hit. I mean, it's okay, but oh wow! Sorry, Eddie. I didn't realize you did. Eddie's like, I had Uruguay in the next two. Sorry, brother. Congrats, Michael, though. That's pretty sick. Yeah, usually one per case. I've had two per case. You know, it's not that rare to have two of them per case. But that kind of sucks because usually when we have two per case, that means, uh, you know, we have, like, we're missing something else. So we don't get any host city or no champions cards. Or Usually we get seven boxes that are the autos. And then we have the one box that's the landmarks. Uh, and then we have usually one box that is Cyrillic. Uh, and then the rest are 
Usually two boxes are the uh, laser boxes, which are the crappy boxes. At least I think they are. And then uh, we have one box that could be either champions or host city or group stage card. You know, one of those deals. Yeah, exactly. Not often. Not often. Yeah, there's a lot of different, you know, there's just so many numbered cards. Like they have Camel, they have Zebra, they have Tie Dye, they have, you know, a million different variations. So I'm not crazy about Tie Dye or Zebra. I always kind of like, not, not Tie Dye, Zebra or Camel. I always kind of like the Tie Dye, was the only one I kind of like. And in this one, I always love the Cracked Ice, the green from 2014. That was one of my favorites. And the Power Gold. Uh, but I'm not crazy about the Camel. And they added the orange to this year, which is kind of... Yeah, the Cracked Ice always was my favorite in 2014. And I love that uh, World Cup Stars set in 2014. That's why I think I have the complete set in purple, red, and blue. Purple and blue, red, I'm missing like a couple cards, I think. All right, speaking of Cyrillic base, I think we got one coming up. Carillo, Hamid, Sal, Al Jassim. Ochoa, Osama Hasawi, uh, that is a Cyrillic base, and that is for Saudi Arabia.
That is Miguel Angel Arroyo. Andy Carrillo, Dirty Ock, uh, Okazaki, Cardboard Connection, yeah. Come on, we need a black, or at least a power gold. Black or power gold, please. Dolberg, Dele Ali, Galisi, Connection Switzerland, Juan Guillermo Cuadrado, 17 of 20 for Colombia, that was one of the last teams taken, Chadley, Red Draxler, Emboji, Torres, See how 182 is faring. Ah, not so good. Still got 14 spots left in that one. So I guess 182 will have to be manana. James Rodriguez blue to 199. Godoy. Honda, Muslera, Gomes, Borges, Falcao, my least favorite is this camo. I just think it's ugly. I don't know. But I prefer the cracked ice even though it's to 25 to the camo to 20. Jachio, Koke, Ndidi, Changun, Ooh, we got our national landmarks. Who is it? Nice one. KDB. KDB. KDB, oh, KDB. Speaking words of wisdom. KDB. KDB, Belgica. Who's got Belgium? Belgium, Chris Coronaga. There you go, Chris. Is our uh, Hawaiian buddy awake? There you go, Chris. It's only 8 o'clock in Hawaii. And he probably even hasn't had dinner yet. Isco. Iran. Korea Republic. Come to Tennessee. <laughs> Coutinho. In case you were wondering, too easy is a Aussie expression. I always got confused by that when I was first because, you know, I'd say something and Rich would say too easy. I'm like, what the heck is he talking about, too easy? But basically, my understanding is that's the equivalent of no problem. Talking about camel cards. I think that's what it means, right? Too easy is equivalent to like no problem. Or it's nothing, something like that. Herrera. Monier. Yeah, okay. Al Mualad. There's uh, 
Ronaldo and Moutinho, and we got some Uruguayan crack. Uruguayan crack. Five of twenty five. Corona, Erickson to 149, red, Puchanajad, Bentner, we got the Asian Cup starting, I think, in two days, right, doesn't it start on the 5th, Gary Cahill, probably in a day, actually, because it probably starts tomorrow, because it's going to be like 12 hours ahead of us, so... Probably in less than 48 hours, I think. Uh, Urena to 199, because it's already the fourth over there. Hasawi. El Jasim. Asensio. Nagatomo. Milligan. Fimbagasen. Last two boxes, guys. Last two boxes. There you go, Chris. Ooh -hoo. Yeah, the KD, that set is really awesome. 409. The on card autos are really sexy. They sell really well, too. Case hit. Is that last one? Is that four oh nine? Yep. Double four oh nine.
Yeah, Suarez and Cavani dual auto. Guys, grab your spots and select 287. That will be the next one I set up a filler for. I filled 286, so if you want any teams, I think it's more likely that we will fill select 287 that we will then we will fill World Cup 182. Autograph, there's Kanisi, there's our autograph, there's Glushikov, leave the auto there, William, Hummels, Giroux, Japan, Connections, Morishige, Al Jasim, Korich. This is 181. Spain, Ericsson, Sommer, Buchanan, Red, William, Lemon, Quist, Kokoran, Abdullah, we'll have that with a Lemon, Quist, please. Dejaga to 199, Blue, Chadley, Kane, Dybala, Kiyotake, Torres, Hazri, Herrera. Now, either this is going to be our case hit or the other one. I'm kind of hoping that it's this one. Because if it is, it could be something really, really sick. Going this way. Got red. If it's our case hit, could be a Ronaldo. Not our case hit. Jao Moutinho, right team, a wrong player. Wow, if I would have shown that, that would have definitely been a false alarm. If I showed that Portugal, I would have thought, oh, we hit it. We got our Ronaldo, but that is not our case hit. Oh, yeah, 182. I was hoping to fill 182 tonight, uh, Kiran, but it's not looking very promising at the moment. Uh, it's been stuck at 14 for the last hour or two. So there's actually one less, 80, 183 has 13 left, 184 has 14. For some reason, 183 has one less team. Oh boy. 
Oh boy, we got an auto, and it looks like it's an insert auto, I think. Mitrovic. Lamar. De Gea. Kimmich. Right, let me take this one out. El Ahmadi. All right, let's save that autograph right there. We'll get back to that momentarily. Patricio. Muslera. Yerenak. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. I'm about to lose control of Inkula, and I think I like it. Nacho, I'm bummed. I can't believe it. Liverpool got so unlucky today. El Saeed. They definitely deserved better than a loss. Perez, I should have got a tie out of that. Gabriel Jesus. Hector. Hazard and Lukaku. Man City got lucky. They hit the post and the ball went in. Kasama. Liverpool hit the post and the ball didn't go in. That was the difference. And it cost me because I had bet the tie. I would have got 200 bucks if that tie came through. I only bet like 55, but still. Would have paid 200 bucks. Matuidi. When I was 1 1, I thought I had it. I was like, that's it. I'm in the money, Bolanos, but not meant to be, Giroud, Sal, uh, Morocco, I still think Liverpool, I don't know, I think Liverpool will hold on, Gotze and Mueller, Liverpool I think has the easier schedule the rest of the way, Subasic, Mehmedi, they only have three more games against the big teams, and I think Man City has like five more games against big opponents. Spooked. Yeah, one inch for the tie. That's right. All right, here we go. Good luck, good luck. What do we got? Uh, that's what I thought we had. And it's going this way. It's a case hit, and it's 19. You know who that's going to be. Diego Armando Maradona signature moments. I think that's the more short print one than his regular auto. That one's tougher to hit. I believe that is P.I.T.T. Uh, P.I.T.T. it is. There you go, it he, buddy. Congrats, my brother from another mother. You got yourself some Diego Armando Maradona. Nice hit there. Signature moments. Alrighty, recap time, guys. Recap time. Wow, do we really have no purple cards in this whole case? Is that a purple? Sometimes I'm like colorblind and I mistake purple for red, but no, no purples. That happens sometimes. It's weird. Not a single purple in this case. We got orange to 65, Mueller, Embolo, and Perez. What happened there? Having some technical difficulties here. All right, and then uh, pink laser, Biglia, Mamedi, and Asensio. And then we had Cyrillic base uh, Osama Hassawi for Saudi Arabia. Then we had a couple of camel. 
Cards, Cuadrado, Colombia to 20. Shakiri, Switzerland to 20. We also had a tie-dye to 25, Jose Jimenez. Then our autographs, Nacho, Nigeria, Moutinho, Portugal, Sigurdsson, Iceland, and Cuadrado, Portugal. Then going up to the wall, we had Aryan Robin, Signature Moments, 2010 for the Netherlands. Then we had you down with KDB. Yeah, you know me. National Landmarks, KDB, Belgium. Champions, 1974, Franz Beckenbauer and Sepp Meyer and Paul Breitner and Gerd Müller and all those guys. Uh, Germany, 1974. That's number to 25, by the way. That's the Mojo version, 23 of 25. Then we had this sick puppy right here, Luis Suarez and Edison Cavani, dual autograph, Uruguay, 26 of 35. And then this sick puppy as our case hit, and the, yeah, oh, he made it almost. That top part is touching a little bit. Diego Armando Maradona, signature moments, 1986. FIFA World Cup champions. There you have it, folks. A uh, nice little case there. Fortunately, not a ton of hits, but did have a few really nice ones. Uh, all right, let me end this, and then we shall get on with select.